Friday night in the West Bottoms, and it's supposed to be the last hot, hot, hot day of the year. Hopefully by next Tuesday, it is down to normal temperatures for our wonderful auction we have. We have not one, but two of these Hoosier style kitchen cabinets in the auction on Tuesday night. And then a lot of other really nice furniture. <clears throat> this is a very sweet little four drawer, five drawer mahogany uh, bow front chest. It is only about 24, 26 inches across. Very narrow, very unique size, hard to find. This marble top coffee table from the late 50s, early 60s is really super, super duper cool. Some neat big uh, candlesticks, more nice furniture. Really like a little swag, Hollywood Regency type coffee table with the black glass top. Little Ethan Allen side table there. Some of the cloisonne. These are cool. This is a you know, Mickey Mouse Walt Disney Productions chalkboard, and then this is a one of those little. Let's see, copy 1938. Oh, there we go. Nope. You know, it's got the rolling thing. Cool patio set, nice little uh, table there, iron cut out. The rug is hand woven, nice good looking pair of uh, mahogany end tables there. There's the first of two marble top washstands. First of two game tables, kind of like a handkerchief table. These all fold out from the corners. Got the leather top in there. Has a very strong baker look to it, uh, but it's not. Real nice cheval mirror, newer but very good looking. Some brass and glass light fixtures, really good looking table. That's kind of like a pump. This is a wonderful old piece. Real nice little drop front desk. Check out the exposed dovetails on the front of the drawers. Real nice. Some nice old paintings in the auction. Kind of like the Chinese checkerboard collection. The cover on the right is actually Mark Dresden, I believe, and that's uh, probably a Weller piece there. This mahogany desk, you can clean it up a little bit, nice green leather top. But it also has pull-out surfaces on the sides, on both sides, actually. Just going to pump in this one, I forget. Oh, here we go. Old Colony Furniture Company. Good looking piece, great looking old pie safe there. Really like the china cabinet. Nice little nineteen thirties French style. A lot of nice uh, molding to it. An original uh, illustration there. Very good looking uh, antique painting here as well. Nice floor. For some reason, I really like the coal shovel. I'm not sure why. Just cool. Nice lantern. Another game tail. Like like really like the return of town bamboo type legs on there. Really good looking 1840s, 1860s uh, buffet. Check out the real nice big dovetails on that. More cloisonne and uh, Asian pots. Really wonderful garden pad. Nice big size. Here's a second Hoosier type cabinet. Nice old white paint on there. Like the two little push em up games. Reminds me of uh, the guy in. Crocs on um, Swamp People. Shoot them! Here's another really good Asian lamp. Uh, very nicely painted. Check that out. You can see the seam and the pottery right there was put together. Very good looking piece of pottery. Came out of a state that had wonderful items in it. Nice four, uh, what was that? Two over four serpentine front claw foot with attached mirror bird's eye maple dresser. Pretty nice old piece there. Good looking wicker piece, Lifetime Furniture Company here. Good looking uh, Spanish arts and crafts type. Good looking pair of oak judges chairs, courtroom chairs. Probably the whole thing is nice, pretty cool. Nice mirror. Probably Birkin Gay, came out of the same place as the Birkin Gay bedroom set. This kind of a cool box full of notions. There are three of these Victorian whatnot shelves, hanging corner shelves. Nice little English oak dresser with a mirror. These chairs are really cool. I know Victorian chairs aren't the most popular thing in the world right now. The rattan is good in all four, and they have very nice carving on the backs. There's the other marble top washstand. This piece here is really cool. I think it's a bank table. 
Just beautiful finish on it. Great color. Ivory around the escutcheon for the keys. Look at those big hand cut dovetails. So I this with one hand. I'm going to put this down for a second. In case you got the bronze there. Oh my goodness. Show you the bottom of the drawer. See how much wear and tear that's had over the years. Nice big hand chamfered dove uh, edges there. Great old piece of furniture. And the Santa Cast dogs there. Pretty piece. Good decorative item. I'm not sure what's up with these phones, but they're a lot of fun. The uh, jewelry store went out of business, been around for about 50 or 60 years. There are 11 showcases, including this great old Bronson and this uh, Parker Penn display cabinet. Uh, we'll the other showcase in just a second. Neat little uh, dress form, one uh, of the adjustable type. Theater seats. KitchenAid mixer, some accessories. Ethan Allen table and six with the leaves. Here are uh, two, four, five, six more of the showcases, including a revolving top. And these three in the middle are nice old ones, kind of like the one we have up front. Really like this chest of drawers. It needs a fair amount of work. It needs probably a whole new set of hardware, some veneer work on it. But just a really good early form. Again, check out those big hand cut dovetails. I have to take my word for it, but there's chamfering on the bottom. Stickly mirror. Kind of cool. Alrighty, so stained glass windows, big armoire. Little Coca Cola stuff. Valhalla Cutlery Company, little decorative object. Objet de art. Nice little brass and glass coffee table, some wicker, some project pieces in the back. Oh, here's the Birkin Gay bedroom set. We need to do a little bit of cleanup on that and uh, a little bit of glue job. So we have books on there and we don't have the mirror on the top yet. But a uh, real nice little uh, bedroom set there. Nice big dresser and then the vanity with the mirror. We'll get those cleaned up before the auction, that's for sure. These showcases here are really quite wonderful. Very narrow, probably about 40 inches across. Two pieces, uh, they step back. Um, sliding glass doors in the front. We do have the keys for all of them. And there are three of these. These are fantastic for booths and malls because they would go flat against the wall. Uh, they would hold a lot of jewelry, uh, figurines, a lot of just great display workspace in them. Um, just if, you, if you're looking for or need anything like that, these would be great. Another big group of boxes. That the industrial rolling rack there that is for sale. That's a consignment piece. Some new totes, some box lots. This card here is full of, I believe, is basically just vintage Christmas. These are super cool. I'll talk more about the Hollywood collection in the second video. But I have never seen movie posters like these before. I don't think they're silent film, I think they're just after the silent film era. But check out those colors. And they're all wrapped in this cellophane type uh, material. And they have the same look to them. And there's actually a fifth one on top of these cases we didn't get our old. Alright, well, I'm going to. Well, it's a long video. I need to stop this, uh, or else YouTube won't allow us to load it. And we'll get to the front.